What did you think of this whole LeBron James may have been playing with a broken hand the last three games? Uh, come on, man. Stop it. Stop it. Look, I've, I've been on this show, and you can attest to this. I've been the biggest LeBron James apologist. Yeah. Uh, I, I feel that he was my MVP. I still feel that he's my MVP. But stop. I don't know if this came from your lips, LeBron, but stop it. You got swept. You deal with it. The Warriors won. And what ticks me off, because it makes him look so weak. You come to the press conference with your hand wrapped. Are you kidding me? I mean, this – if it – if it, I'm sure it happened. I'm sure he did hit a, a wall and broke it. I'm sure that did happen. But it can't come from your lips. It's got to come from a teammate. It's got to come from a trainer. It's got to come from a Cavs official. But it can't come from you, LeBron, because it makes you look weak. You can't come to the press conference after game four with it wrapped. You didn't come to it wrapped after game one. You didn't come with it wrapped after game two or game three. But all of a sudden, you've been playing with a broken hand for three games. Come on, man. I love you. You're my MVP. But stop, man. That's weak. That is a weak move. It almost felt like it was to take attention away from being swept. Come on, man. I love you, LeBron. I mean, you are a bad dude. But, man, stop it. And I'm, I think it's true. I think he, he probably did break it or fracture it or bruise it. I'm sure he was ticked off after the meltdown. I get that. And I'm sure he did hit a wall, but it can't come out from you. It could come out. It could come out from JR. It could come out from Tristan, Kevin Love, Ty Lu. One of them should, should say it, but it can't come from you. Now, am I wrong on that? Did he say that at the press conference or did someone else say that? Because I'm sure Twitter is firing up right now. It can't come from you. And whoever taped his hand, you did him a disservice. <laughs> you did him a disservice because you know everyone's going to say, LeBron, what's wrong with your hand? I know. I know. Yeah, you know, get through the press conference. You got through the game. You dapped everybody out. Thank shook you. hands. Thank you. Get through the press conference and then let the report come out from Brian Windhorst or somebody else. Thank you. And Thank then, you. And then, then you can go, hey, I did, but let's not take away from Golden State winning the title. And, uh, you know, I look forward to a decision coming up here in a couple of weeks here. And uh, hopefully I get a chance at him again. Something like that. You have you have a gig in PR if this radio <laughs> television thing falls through. Seriously, because come on, man. Who's ever around LeBron should have told him that, man. Okay. You can't be the baddest dude in the league and then come out with this. For more Dan Patrick Show, tune to Audience Channel 239 on DirecTV or download the Dan Patrick Show app.